Stevenson gets a big 78-72 win over Albright today. Glenn Clark with Cameron Sapienza and Nate Arrington. Uh, Cam, I'm going to start with you. Let's just say it. Nate really failed you. Didn't get a double-double today. Ridiculous, man. Like He had had like three straight double-doubles before today. Just a real awful game from him, right? <laughs> yeah, it was, it was bad. You need to play better, man. <laughs> Nate, you've been in his zone. And in fact, ended up almost flirting with a triple-double today. I uh, didn't end up getting there. But Nate, the zone that you've been in these last couple games, doing everything scoring rebounding assists today um where has this sort of come from and how good do you feel right now well, i've been inspired by coach stewart he's uh been pushing me hard so that's where it's come from he's motivated me every day in practice to do better Kim, you and i were talking after the game the other day about how the shots have been falling in practice they just got to start falling in games yep. a day like today where you have a couple jumpers go down in the second half how much does that do for your confidence moving forward it does i just wanted to see one go in and you know it start going i knew when i hit one i knew the next one was going in so coach Stu just told me to keep shooting and it's eventually gonna fall so one of the things that jumped out to me even in the first half you had the opportunity to take a three but you immediately saw there was a path to the basket is yep. is it difficult for you sometimes where you're like you you want that three like you want to get that and but you know this is the right thing to do yeah i know i mean coach uh coach Stu doesn't sometimes like his contested threes saying the softest palm water so sometimes you got to take it to the <laughs> hole you know get some contact in there so that's what I had to do. Nate, I want to talk to you about free throw shooting. It's something that not every big man is particularly good at, but it's something that you've been really good at. It have, has it always been that way for you? They've been comfortable shooting free throws. No, I was actually a 53% free throw shooter last <laughs> year. But this this summer, I worked hard on it, so I've gotten better. Man, I mean, like, how many free throws were you putting up on a day-to-day -day uh, basis? Like 500 a day. I was really trying to get better. <laughs> Clearly, it's working out, by the way. I hope so. <laughs> All right, let's talk about the part that we have to talk about from today. Uh, closing out games a little bit better, right? And like, what what do you guys need to do? Look, a win's a win, and you're happy to have the win. But what do you need to do better moving forward in conference play? Probably just keep up the same pace of play. I mean, when we get up in a uh, 20, 15, 20-point 20 lead, we tend to, you know, slip off and play softer and, you know, not play with that same pace as when we increase the lead. So... You know, there was a lot of time left when we got up to, well, I think we were up 22, 23. We got up, it was probably nine minutes left, and then we just kind of, as Coach said, we just kind of flatlined, but we just got to stick it out because a lot of our guys work hard in practice that haven't been in since November. So it's on us that we got to get them on the floor and, you know, work hard till the, till the end. Oh, yeah. Yeah. A win's a win. It's a good week. All right. Uh, we've been trying to get to know guys better these last couple of weeks. So I'm going to put this one to you. Uh, Nate, if you were in charge of postgame meals moving forward, what would the postgame meal be? Um, it'd have to be some kind of sub. Anything but pizza, I'd have to it, say. Really? Yeah. Anything but pizza. All right. You, give me the go to sub then, right? Like today, if you could have any sub in the world, what would it be, right? Meatball sub. Meatball sub. That's not a bad answer. Cam, what about What's that? Like meatballs. All right. I like that. Cam, what about you? If you were in charge of uh, the postgame meals moving forward, what would they be? Uh, that's tough. I'd, I'd like subs, too. I mean, we've had too much pizza the last few years <laughs> in the away games, but probably a cheesesteak from Angelo's. All right. I Philly, like that. In Philly. Yep. Like it's my go-to spot. Very good. Very you gotta spot. At some point, you got to try John's Roast Pork when you're up there. We'll, we'll work on that. Uh, who are we going to shout out? Who you need to say hello to? Uh, shout out my mom. My brother, my father, my dog. Love you guys all. What's your dog's name? Mac. That's awesome. Now, Cam, what about you? Shout out to my family. He comes every game. Appreciate it. No doubt. Man. Guys, congratulations on a big win and a good week here at home. Thank you. Nate Arrington, Cam Sapienza, Glenn Clark. Go Mustangsports.tv.